Hey fellow tennis nerds, I hope all is well. If I look sweaty, it's because I just came from the tennis court, played a session with the new Prince Tech Stream Tours, more about that on Patreon soon and on my YouTube channel very soon, as well as tennisnerd.net. But this video is not about Prince Racket, it's about Marin Silic and his impressive run at the French Open. He's now in the semifinals. He's not had maybe the best months leading up to that, but he's a little bit up and down streaky player. If he plays well, he can reach the final or even win a Grand Slam as he did in 2014 in the US Open, but he's been in the Wimbledon final and he can be a very, very strong competitor. And he plays aggressive tennis, big serve, follows it in, runs around to the forehand. He's been painting lines in this tournament and playing some impressive attacking tennis. So all the best to Marin in his upcoming match. But the racket he's using, it looks like this. It's um, This is the Prestige Tour from 2021. It's 95 square inches, 1619 pattern. It's actually similar in, in the way of, of certain specs to what he used to use, which was the TGK 231.3, but he switched some years back from the what was a microgel radical MP with an open pattern to a Prestige Rev Pro, a pro stock. So he's not using this one, he's actually using a racket based on this one, the Rev Pro, a racket not liked by everyone, but I really find it interesting. It has a very, very whippy feel, 93 square inches, obviously not the easiest to defend with, but when you're attacking, like Silic does, you get a lot of you know maneuverability with the smaller head size. You can really go for your shots because it has a lot of precision and, and control. And the 1619 pattern gives you some spin and it does feel more powerful than the stiffness rating suggests. What is different with Silic racket is that he has the layup of his old racket. So the dot one, that's usually the case for the Prestige Rev Pro, 312.1. In his case, it's 312.2, meaning it's the microgel radical MP layup. So he's using his old layup in a slightly smaller head, a different frame. That's what the pros sometimes do. Murray tried the new Prestige MP uh, with his PT57A layup. So head can do stuff for you if you're a top player and you want some changes to your frame. And they're very accommodating in that sense. It's a very interesting frame. I like this one a lot. It's whippy, serves well. You go for your forehand, it's not for you defensive guys. Obviously, Silic doesn't use it in stock form. He adds quite a bit of weight to his frame. So let's look at his specs. This is from Pro Stock Tennis, actually selling his racket. I'm not sure it's still for sale, but it, it's there. Strong swing weight, 371. So a lot of weight at 12 o'clock in the head. So 93 square inches, 12.2 strong weight in ounces, 345 grams. That is 32.5 centimeter balance, uh, 58 stiffness. So this is pretty plush frame, but it doesn't feel as good as some old school plush frames in the retail version. But maybe in Marin's layup, it feels good. I actually used to own his older frames and really liked playing with those. Uh, so I'm very curious how this would feel, but it's very difficult to find at 312.2. 1619 string pattern, that's how the Rev Pro is, is created. Silicone in the handle, lead under the grommets. And that's pretty much all you need to know about Marin Silic racket. It's not a racket for most of us, but it works well for him, as you can see. The racket needs to suit you as a player type. That's always the case. And this one seems to suit him really well. And I don't see him switching to any bigger head size or anything anytime soon, considering his results. And if this room looks messy today, it's because I got the delivery of a new stringing machine. Mine broke down a few weeks ago, and now I have a head machine that is in the background that I'm gonna get started using but yeah I had a lot of boxes and stuff today to to fix so it's a messy room sweaty guy messy room it's YouTube that's all for now have a nice day and don't forget to play some tennis